Good morning, guys. I just got up, um, and I'm going to start getting ready for the day. Uh, I have a couple things to wear today. I have lunch later. I have the Raptors game. I know we're going for dinner after. I don't know what we're doing after that. But, yeah, so I'll show you what I usually do to get ready in the morning and then my day. So let's get started. So on the weekends, what I usually do because I like to sleep in, uh, I'll wake up at, like, 11, and then if I have time, I'll usually do some sort of, like, uh, spin class or something like that. But today I'm not going out to do spin class because I have to go to lunch, so I'm going to do one in the basement. I'll kind of show you guys what I'm doing, I guess, but yeah. Okay, guys, I'm about to start my class. Uh, it's 45 minutes long, so I should be done around 11, 10-ish. And then I'm going to shower and start getting ready, so I'll see you guys after my workout. 45 minutes, pop guys. The play that's ahead of us is featuring Justin Bieber, Will I Am, Black Eyed Peas, Britney Spears, and it's all about the music and having fun with that. So, guys, I just finished my workout, so my morning is done, I guess. Like, my actual, like, before I start my day. So I'm gonna go upstairs, shower. I'm not gonna have breakfast, I usually don't, but like, especially today, because we're going for lunch. And yeah, so, I will show you guys my, sorry, the light. Um, I'll show you guys my morning routine, like, getting ready. Guys, so I just got, I just got out of the shower, and um, I'm ready to start my morning routine. So, basically, what I usually do is I'll just like comb my hair over, just to start. And then, because my hair is all wet and I need it to be not in a quick period of time, I'm gonna grab my oops, Dyson blow dryer and plug that in. And I'll show you my technique for getting my hair dry fast and volumish. Okay, so basically it's like really loud, so I don't know if you can hear me. So I'm just going to explain it first. What I'll do is I'll just keep going from this side. And then once it's all over this side, this side. And sometimes in the front just to like make it go up and voluminous. So yeah, here we go. Now that my hair is up and dry, you can see it's like wavy on the sides. So next what I do is I'll take a straightener basically and make sure it's all straight and not wavy. And this also gets rid of a lot of the frizz from the hair dryer and just like make sure everything's together. Like basically like it basically heats everything together. But what happens is this takes a little while to heat up. So what I'm gonna do is I just put it on 450. And then I should mine at the very, very end of my whole routine. But because I need to like fix up my face, I need to grab a hair band or a hair lot and like put my hair back. Just so it doesn't get in the way. I know I look like a psycho right now, but whatever. You know what? We're gonna have to deal with it. Oh, okay. I just cut my hair recently, so like it's probably not gonna all stay in there. Whatever. Yeah. So, what am I gonna start with today? Oh, uh, right. Okay. So I've been. So I actually just started using this last night, but I don't know if it's like working yet. And I don't know exactly. So I think this is is a toner. It's like an acne clearing gel toner. So I'm gonna actually. You know what? Not gonna use that right now. I'm gonna use that later. But I'm going to start off with cream. I'm using this La Mer Moisturizing Cream. Just because I was using this other cream and it dried on my skin like crazy. So I need to find like something with super, super moisture just to like give it all back. It's still not back. I've been using this cream for so, like literally a week and my skin is still dry. But that's also because of the winter. So there's nothing I can do but the winter. Sadly. I just like to rub that into my hands now because we can't waste any of this. And then 
what I'll do now while that is drying is I'll brush my teeth. So that like sets into the skin. Okay, yeah, now that I like wet my toothbrush and my phone fell everywhere after I turned on my faucet, I'm gonna just brush my teeth. Oh, let this hair loose. Oh, see, I like that because it pushes it back, but I'm going to grab my straightener now, 450 degrees, ready to burn my face off. And I'm going to Okay, easy peasy. Okay, now I'm going to take, I mean, I've switched through so many things, but I'm using this Away Matte Pomade, which, um, if you guys want to know exactly what products I use and, like, you want to know where I got them, you can follow me on Instagram, fits underscore in underscore the underscore six, it's always at the end of the video, and, um, I'm going to put it down in the description too, you can DM me and just ask me and I will probably answer. If you're lucky, J Oh, that was way too much work. Okay. Now I just work that through my hair. Make sure it stays in place throughout my day. It also ties everything together because the pieces are a mess, but whatever. We're going to deal. really like it oh i haven't hair blow drying my hair in so long you guys don't even understand because what i usually do is i'll wash my hair at night and then i'll put uh leave-in conditioner or something in it to make sure it doesn't move during the night and i'll just um straighten that in i know that's bad for your hair but whatever uh, it's time to choose out my outfit for the day what i'm going to be wearing to dinner lunch and their after skin today so yeah Guys, so it's time to choose my outfit. I have an idea in mind, uh, but it's just if I can find the things or not. So let's go for a hunt in my closet. And we are going to figure out what I am going to wear. I'm thinking these jeans that I have, this long oversized shirt, and then these boots that I found that I actually love and I didn't think I would fit in, but I do. So yeah, let's find the stuff. So these are the jeans. Let's just like, rip them out here. Yeah. I'm thinking either these are black jeans. So I'm just gonna toss those here on the bed. Next, the shirt. Okay, so I found the shirt. This is my oversized shirt. I think that will go, um, maybe I might wear black pants actually. Let's grab a pair of black pants and see maybe which pair that is the question. Oh no, definitely not those, those do not fit me. Okay, um, yep. Where are these pants going? I literally just looking at them last night. Uh, whatever, I'll just throw these ones. Okay, throw those there. Uh, yeah. And next, I have my shoes over here. Let's put it all on and see if we like it. Guys, so I just finished getting ready. So I chose these pants because the other ones did not fit, which is just great. So yeah, these fit. And then I have these shoes on. You can see a full look later. But yeah, so I, uh, I'm just gonna be waiting around for my father to get ready. So bye. We're all a little bit late getting ready, so we're going straight to the game. We're not gonna be, um, well, that's really bright. We're not gonna be, uh, going to lunch anymore. No. So yeah. Oh, no one wants to hear from you. No. Okay, bye. No. Guys, we just got to the Platinum Lounge. Um, the and it's 40 minutes till the game, so we just ordered some food to have a little bit of a snack before the game because uh, we were late getting out the door, so we had to skip lunch, but we're going to have dinner after, and yeah, this is literally like just a mess. Just kidding. Okay, bye. Yeah. 
Um, we just finished. Hey guys! Oh, well, here comes the bullying starting again. Okay. Hi, I'll see you at the restaurant. Guys, so we just got to the restaurant. We're gonna order our food. And, yeah. We just left the restaurant and we are heading home. Oh, yeah, I actually really like this. Oh, I like this. Um, and we're just jumping in a taxi to head home and uh, start the relaxing part of my night. Thank God. Guys, so we just got home. I'm just going to be watching uh, my favorite show, Empire, right now for probably the next couple hours. <laughs> oh, nothing. I wasn't talking to you. I was talking to the vlog. Um, but yeah, so I'm going to be doing that. What are you doing? Stop. You're being weird. Okay, yeah, and then I'm going to show you my nighttime routine, so I'll see you then. Guys, so now that my day is basically officially over and I'm ready to go to sleep, I am going to do my nighttime routine. So my nighttime routine always changes depending on, like, what products I have or, like, what I'm liking right now. So, but there's one thing that always, I always start with, which is this multi-miracle glow. You know, I'm all about the glow. Um... <laughs> It's, but it's actually a cleanser. It's a cleanser, mask, and balm for baby soft skin. But I use it as a cleanser to just make sure all the dirt and oil gets out of my face from the day. So yeah, I put, you guys hear my sink is like over here. So you'll see me like wash my face. But this is really, really nice because it's a balm, which means it's basically oil-based, which means it won't foam. And it actually, it's much better for your skin than just regular cleansers and, um, yeah, and, like, white, like, cleansing wipes and, uh, the, whatever it's called. I forget the name of it. It's that water thing. That and wipes and regular cleansers aren't the best for your skin. So, that's why I use this. Anyway, I want to show you guys. I actually want to show you guys. Look. So I have water in my hand. I rub it and see there's no like bubbles. It just turns into more of like an oily, like you can obviously tell it's soap. You can't tell it's like bubbles. So because. Okay. Now that I washed that off, I'm what I'm going to do is I'll just clean up these edges of my hair because it gets in my hair. And I'll just dab in my eyes. And now that my face is still wet from that, I'm going to take my second cleanser. That was just to get all the, um, like, oil and grossness from pollution off my skin. Now, this is like a cleanser that will get deep in the skin and clean it. What I'm using right now that I actually just got the other day is this Acne Clearing Wash from Peter Thomas Roth. It has 2% salic acid, which will really help with acne and just pimples and cleaning up my skin which I'm all about right now so yeah I'll just take a little little bit of that you'll see this is more of a foam let me put this one you'll see yeah so it's more foamy than the other one because the other one was a bubble okay <laughs> Now that I'm done that, I'm going to fully dry my face. And my face is uh, fully clean now. Ooh. Yeah. My face is fully clean now. Let me just close this up so it doesn't knock over. Next, I am going to put on this toner, which is going to really, really get at these the acne and pimples it's um a clearing gel so i use this as a toner they don't call it a toner but it basically is i think hopefully that's what i'm using it for at least and it also has two percent salic acid it helps clear up and prevent acne so i just put about like one two three squirts on that and i just rub that all into my skin what i will do is they'll just make sure all that product gets deep into my skin this is really good for acne scars
I'll show you guys what I do after the clean this. I'll show you in one second. Okay, now that I have, my, you'll see my face turns red because of course you're putting needles in your face. It's gonna happen. So what I do is I have my, um, what is it? rubbing alcohol and I'll just spin this fast and I'll spray my rubbing alcohol on it. So I'll go. I'll just shake it and I'll just pop it back in my drawer. And next, what I'm going to do is I'm going to put on my moisturizer. Same one as this morning, so it should be out somewhere. Where is it? Oh, uh, that's really awkward. I guess I forgot to step. Well, usually after I wash my face, I'll put on these, but I totally forgot. It's hiding in here. I don't know why they're in there. And I'm going to take the same cleanser as this morning, the La Mer Moisturizing Cream, because as you know, my face is really dry and acne creams so let me tell you they dry up your skin because that's basically their job is to dry up all the oil that's gonna make acne so you need to make sure you're well hydrated or you'll just start flaking and looking really gross and we don't want that so There we go. Next, I'm gonna take this acne spot and area treatment and just plop a little tiny, tiny bit on all the places I have acne. What I usually do is I'll put just a glob of it on one finger, close this back up. And with my other finger, I will just take a little bit of off this at a time. And just put that over where it's Same kind of idea. And then, of course, after I'm just going to brush my teeth and do that sort of stuff. But yeah, so it's time for me to go and sleep. And I hope you guys enjoyed this. I know it was a lot jammed into one day. Some things got cancelled. Some things happened that was unexpected. But yeah, I enjoyed filming this because it's just like my day to day. And of course, like it was awkward like in like a restaurant or something filming. But whatever, I don't really care. Um, yeah, if you guys like these kind of videos, comment down below and tell me, I will make sure I will do more of them, and if you have any other ideas for me, please do comment those down below as well. And remember, like and subscribe, I really enjoyed filming this video for you guys, I hope you enjoyed it as well, and I will see you on the next one. See you later.